All right, so we back here once again, and this time we're here to do these double XL freshman freestyles. Today we got Lil Key, Polo G, and Jack Harlow. I already feel like Lil Key's probably gonna be the one that I'm gonna least like the most. But my favorite out of this group of people right now, I ain't even gonna lie, it was Jack Harlow at first, but then I sat down and I listened to Polo G's project. And yeah, man, Polo G, like, he became one of my favorites. So yeah, without further ado, man, we finna get into it. These double XL freshman freestyles. Let's go. Okay. Mm. Okay, Jack Harlow first. All right. I'm that man. I can't trip because it's way off brand. I had plans for the playoffs, damn. City used to hate, but I made y'all fans. Oh, man. I hit them both ways. Ain't y'all friends? She know. First of all, let's talk about how this production already. It sounds like some shit that Jack Harlow will rap off of. Like, it's giving me uh, what's popping vibes. What? Okay. Fuck the game up, but I'm popping cherries. The disrespect. The disrespect in the middle of my damn video. The disrespect. Wait, wait, did you just forget your nigga? Did you just forget your word? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, this man just screams like, this man just screams like 2015, 2014 Young Thug to me, bro. Like, I just, it's just something about this dude, bro. Like, I just cannot get with for real. Okay, I'm waiting on Polo G. This is all I care about. And I'm really in my bag. She wanted I'm paying for it. Bitch, I put in blood, sweat, and tears, and I ran for it. Oh. Trapping just to make a way. Got stuck up in that jam for it. Bag of chip died. No, I couldn't put out my hand for it. Mm. Now I'm that nigga in my city and yours. I'm so quick to put him in a place like a landlord. They Ooh. don't care what you believe if you don't make a stand for it. Look, I got niggas mad because I'm blessed and I'm winning. Only if they really knew this was just the beginning. Mm. With that weapon he spinning. Smith and Weston was spitting. This hot shit of cooking noodle in less than a minute. Mm. This do put that salt in his mouth. I have my killers come and paint the walls in his house. Ooh. He activated soul hollows log in the mouth. Lost his mind, seen that blood from his dog spilling out. I was on the front line, standing tall in the drought. I've been going hard like I got a ball for the scouts. Mm. I'm polar with my love because I fall in and out. These new generation gangsters do it all for the clout. Mm. With the whole hood on my back, I had to carrier i stacked against me number crime in my area oh generation millionaire i had to break the barriers trying to open up my third eye it's only getting scarier damn a new disease drop causing mass hysteria mm. it's always some bullshit welcome to america nigga talk your shit polo talk your shit polo and you took over the damn th man uh, all right this cypher was decent jack carlo um he started it off but he ain't really i don't know he ain't really do much like I don't know, I was sort of expecting more from him. And then it's like with the whole, like with the production as a whole, like it just sound like some, it just sound like what's popping. But instead of him actually writing the verses, it sound like he just freestyled the whole thing. Lil Key, bro, like, I, oh man. I try to give people like the benefit of the doubt, but it's like just my, my whole thing with Lil Key, bro, he just sounds like. Old Young Thug. Like, he just sounds like 2015, 2014 Young Thug when, like, he was still trying to, like, you know what I'm saying, discover his voice and shit. But, like, yeah, Lil' Key, he really did not do anything for me. How the fuck, how you forget? Like, he, I don't know if he did that on purpose, but I'm pretty sure he forgot his damn verse. I'm going crazy. I get lazy. Then we get to Polo G, the person that, like, I was expecting more from Jack Harlow, but... Like I said, bro, I've been listening to Polo G ever since the, you know what I'm saying, the, the list got announced. And I done made a reaction video to his project and everything. Bro, Polo G gave me pretty much, like, the shit I just listened to on the album. Like, he just gave me that, but in cypher form. Pretty sure it was written or whatever. Like, we can get into that whole uh, freestyle and, you know what I'm saying, like, we can get into that whole little debate at, later on. But 
just the way you know what I'm saying. Polo G did this thing like it was. It, it, he did. He pulled the XXX dunk, bro. Cut the beat and just did his own thing. So right now, if I had to rank this cipher, it'll be Polo G number one, Jack Harlow number two, and Lil Key number three. Let me know how y'all feel about these ciphers in the comment section. Like, let me know if y'all impressed by them anything. Right now, just based on this one right here, I wasn't really impressed for real. But at the same time, like I, I really like Polo G the most out of this whole little cypher so yeah also please be sure to leave suggestions as far as like different songs albums or artists that you guys think that i should listen to also please be sure to follow me at the social media app right here and remember to hit that subscribe button because man we're trying to get to that goal of 10,000 subscribers before the end of the year pretty sure we can do it and i feel like anything is possible and this is one of those possibilities so yeah this is T Sign Out once again, man. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to follow me at the social media app right here. And yeah, peace.